don't touch anything. <laughs> that part is scary. You guys ready to check it out? Good morning, we are headed to Utah on an airplane in like an hour and a half and the kids are being so helpful this morning. I've been amazed at the jobs they're able to do. It's stuff that usually just Jeremy and I are doing and they're taking out the trash, they're making lunch, they're packing bags. So Kendra has all of the clothes bagged and numbered for which day they're gonna be worn and Isaac is packing it up. So we are in the car and we're headed to the airport. There is not a tornado in sight. In fact, there's not even a storm in sight. So that's good news. We're running a little bit late, which is why Jeremy just went through a yellow light. It was yellow. yellow. It was kind of orange. It was yellow. It was a little bit orange. <laughs> it was not red though. Someone's gonna see Grandma and Papa. Yeah, we're gonna see Grandma and Papa. We're going to Utah. Utah. Yeah, Utah is my favorite day. Oh. Okay, <laughs> raise your hand if you were born in Utah. Hey, Laura, you were born in Kansas City. Oh, yeah. Me and Isaac were born in Utah. Yeah, should we go see the house where you guys were born at? <gasps> yes! So Kendra and I aren't from Utah. We just went to school there. I did law school there and then we moved to Kansas City. So we're basically headed to our beginning. This is where Jeremy and I met. This is where we were living when we first got married and had Isaac and Elise. And so it's full of wonderful memories. So we're excited to share some of that with the kids. And CVX Live is happening. So we're gonna see a bunch of YouTube friends. What? Well, this is not our first time flying with all five kids, but I don't know if I'm ever going to not be nervous about flying with five kids. I feel like we're driving up to the airport terminal and I'm like, all right, game face on, this is it. Molly had to come with us this time. And I have her signature. Nice. So the way we do this when we go to the airport is Jeremy drops me and all the kids except for Caleb off and then he goes and parks the car and comes and gets us. We're waiting for a bus. I can see it coming, but I put the bag inside out with our car seats. So before the bus gets here, I have to try to fix that. There's the bus. Let's make this happen. I just got it in time. Just barely. Did we make it? Mm-hmm. That was close. I always feel like we look a little crazy walking through the airport. We're going fast? Good thing we only have 25 minutes till they board our plane. Uh-oh. Kendra was just making fun of me for forgetting my laptop last time. She's all, did you remember your laptop? Yeah, I got it. Oh. Hi. It's a big event when our family gets on a plane. Thank you guys. All right, let's go. They're pretty excited. Did you guys want to look in here? Oh, look in there, you guys. Look. Oh, say hi. Check out the cockpit. Say hi to everybody. They let the kids look into the cockpit, and Caleb goes, whoa, that's a lot of buttons. We weren't able to get all six seats together this time, so the boys are a few rows back, and the girls are here with me. Hi. So I was just saying to Kendra that if parenting were the Olympics, then traveling at the airport could be an entire event. Trying to get on the bus, trying to get to ticketing, going through security, sitting on the plane, like, it's amazing. How does the runway make, runway make us go so fast? I think the runway has ice on the bottom and we just slide right down it until we fly up into the air. So before we left the house, I was looking everywhere for one of my pairs of earrings. I had left it on the table and I couldn't find it anywhere. And finally we just had to go and I was like, man, I'm not gonna have my earrings that I love. And guess what? I just opened Laura's backpack and she had packed my earrings. She took them from off the table and she packed them at the bottom of her own bag with some random socks. Did you take my earrings? I had them because I had my ears pulled. Let's see your pierced ears. Oh. You ready? Uh -huh. We're going to Utah, Arizona. No, we're not going to Arizona. We're going to Utah. Utah,
How was it, Elise? It was good. You got it. You got it. Yeah. I got this. So this is a new baby carrier that I have for Janae, and she's loving it. That's awesome. And you're loving it. Good job, team. You think so? Oh, you think so, Janae? This is it, our rental van. We're almost there. We did it almost. Oh, no, now we have to buckle in all the car seats. Hey, but we're getting so close. Cool. We're getting close. Jeremy's pretty much a professional car seat installer at this point. The worst calling in life. <laughs> I birthed the children and he does the car seats and we're calling it even. Yeah. There is an actual opening. What? So you feel cooler driving a van with a sunroof? I always feel cool driving a minivan. Yeah, you do. And you look good doing it. Just in case any of you are wondering, this is why we flew to Utah this year instead of driving. Janae hates the car so much. That would have been 16 hours of a crying baby. So sad. You're too big. Oh my girl. First time. How are you doing, buddy? You are Gemma. Hey. Are your little curls just adorable? Gemma, look, a baby. <laughs> oh, what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> so we're here at Marla's place and she's making dinner for us. Thank you. And it smells yeah. so good. So all day, we've just been off with vlogging with the camera. So what I mean by that is like something cute is happening and we go and we grab the camera and we forget to press record. Maybe it's because we're just trying funny. to travel a thousand miles at the same time and it's hard to do both. Really Maybe. Well. Unless you have ninja cat-like reflexes, which sometimes Jeremy does. Whoa. You want to come roll down the hill? Do you want to go roll down the hill? Yeah. He's going. Copy. Do a somersault. <laughs> oh, Parker, good job. Good job. You failed. Okay. Okay. On your mark. Get set. Go. Faster. 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 <laughs> Caleb, building a snowman, snowman. <laughs> Caleb. Caleb. How do you feel after doing that? Laura, <laughs> right, you want to go down the hill? Not up the hill. We've had some kids that liked grass and some babies that hated it. She's holding her feet up. Oh, where's the poop? What do you think of the grass, big girl? She's just kind of scowling at it like, what is this? <laughs> no, no, not a fan of the grass. <laughs> So we're staying in a rental house for the first couple days that we're here in Utah. We much prefer to stay in rental houses over hotels because instead of getting one room with all of our craziness, we get several rooms. So we're going in to see it now. It's a townhouse and it looks like it's right next to a park. That's awesome. You guys ready to check it out? Mm 
Here's our new place. It's so fun to see a new place you're gonna stay at. It's just like super exciting. This is the master Here's where mom and I will stay. And then what's nice is it has a big old closet. Big old closet. So we can just put Janene in a nursery. Hi. Do you hear the trees? So we got all the kids in bed. It's been a super long day. I'm excited for all the adventures coming ahead. Jay House. This is gonna be a sea monster and a fairy, and she's nervous. <laughs> Duck. Duck. <laughs> One, two, three. Hmm. Hold it. 